well, tell us what they will be singing. And um, I guess that was what was initially agreed on. Just give us some idea about that. Well, he wanted to do uh, the final uh, chorus from Candide, uh, Make Our Garden Grow. And, and that's what he reached out uh, to see if we'd be willing to do that. And it's, it's, not, a, um, it's not an automatic yes. Um, it's a great piece. I mean, singers love, love, love. They love Candide. Um, but this is just such a gorgeous, dramatic, emotional chorus. And the thing is, though, if you don't have singers where you have sopranos who have a nice, beautiful high C that they can hit consistently several times, um, it's just going to be a disaster. People will writhe in their seats <laughs> if it doesn't work. And so, you know, my first thought was, okay, well, I got I to gotta count off the number of high Cs I have in my soprano sections. And, and I knew that was okay. So, and, you know, we were good to go otherwise. Um, the, the singers who I'm bringing, I'm bringing a combined group that's two choirs, um, my two mixed choirs. One is a chamber choir, the Meadows Chamber Singers, and the other is larger mixed choir, Meadows Chorale. I mean, I tell the kids, it's just like, you know, they're, we have these vocal horses, you know. We've got, they're really, really uh, wonderful, uh, big singers. And so uh, something like this is perfect for them. Well, I was going to ask you then, what is, forgetting the issue of balance, whether you have enough, or what else is different about singing with a wind ensemble as opposed to a string orchestra or something? Well, I guess, you know, the fact that it, it is wind and brass instruments, percussion, and for me, you know, that's just going to automatically be a much thicker texture to have to sing through. Um, you know, not that strings aren't a thick texture, but it's a very different kind of thing. And so, you know, there is that, that worry that once, you know, once everybody kicks in, uh, when we get to the, the big climax of this beautiful chorus, um, everybody meaning the wind ensemble. <laughs> it's a lot of everybody's, isn't it? <laughs> it's going to be one of those things where, you know, oh yeah, I th they're singing, I see their mouths moving. Um, can't quite catch the words, but, you know, Bernstein was smart, um, you know, regardless of wind ensemble or full, full orchestra. Again, you've got sopranos singing high C's. They will be heard. <laughs> so if nobody else is, they will be heard. 